Hello everybody and welcome back to Analog Vernacular. Today we're going to be playing some more Persona 3 Portable and most likely we're going to be doing a social link today. But first, I think that we need to come out here and talk to Chihiro again. Vernacular-san, um, about what happened the other day. I sort of overreacted, and I, um, just wanted to say I'm sorry. I get really nervous when I talk to people, although I know I should really do something about it. It's especially bad when I talk to boys. All I can think about is running away in that situation. Let's see. I'm a guy. I, I know, that's why I'm so nervous now. Sorry, I know I can't perform my duties on the student council if I'm like this. I have to try harder to overcome this phobia. Okay. Thank you very much. I'll try to do my best. I don't think she's willing to talk to me anymore. I should try again another time. Okay. Okay. I think today... We've got Chariot at rank 3, we've got Hierophant at rank 2. Um, maybe we'll do Magician, since that's the other one we have a Persona for. You know what? No, we're gonna do Chariot again, I think. Let, let's check it. You had to practice today? I feel as if we can grow closer thanks to Aramatama. I don't think our bond will grow any stronger even if I spend more time with Miyamoto. Okay, so there we go. Um, so he did not get enough affinity points in our last uh, rank up. So maybe Is that right? we'll not do this in hopes that um, we'll get some affinity points somewhere else. I'm not sure how likely that is in the near future, but Yo. we'll just fi we'll fill it out. What's up, dude? I'm going to head out soon. How about you? Looks like Tomochika wants to hang out. I feel as if we can grow closer thanks to the magician persona Nekamata. Should I spend time with him? Let's go. <laughs> huh? You, you coming with? And how about we go for ramen again? I want to hear more about you, too. Man, this always hits the spot. This flavor's pretty addictive, huh? Despite its simple appearance, the soup has a complex flavor that's enhanced by the noodles. By the way, dude, why the hell is your dorm co-ed? Can you, like, just waltz on into Takeba-san's room and stuff? Um, no. Like, what's wrong with you, dude? <laughs> yeah, that's what I thought. Can't win them all, I suppose. Well, I'm not interested in girls her age anyway. I'm more into older women. How about you? <laughs> I like them all. Really? So, you don't discriminate, huh? Interesting, interesting. That's an impressive lifestyle, man. To tell you the truth, this stays between us. I have my eye on someone. This is the secret plan I was talking about. Basically, I'm just gonna ask this girl out. But get this, she's a teacher at our school. Kenji's... A weird guy. This is a bad idea. <laughs> Not like that's gonna stop me from making my move. Uh huh. But you gotta promise you won't tell anyone, okay? It's not like, you know, she couldn't lose her job for something like that, or that it would just be wrong and inappropriate, but you know. It might look weird if a teacher and a student are having a thing, you know? You don't say. He told me a secret plan, and it's an awful one. <laughs> I feel like our relationship is stronger. So this is a good point to also mention that this game has some of the worst and some of the best social links in the entire series. It's wild the fluctuation between the bad and the good. There's like two in particular that I really don't like in this game. This might be one of them. Now me, as a 33 year old man, when we're talking about Persona 5, would I date Kawakami? Yes. 
would I tell my friend to date a teacher who is a teenager in high school? No. I want to date Kawakami as a 33-year-old oh, man. My favorite show is about to start. See ya. But these are two very different things. <laughs> I parted ways with Tamachika and went back to the dorm. Oh, it's you. Welcome back. Okay. Let's talk to everybody. Hey there. I'm sure you're tired of hearing this, but make sure you're fully prepared before going into Tartarus. You never know what'll happen there. There are some aspects to battle that we simply can't manage with an unprepared leader. That's true. I'm sure you don't want to put everyone else in danger, so keep that in mind. Hmm? Is something the matter? Just wanted to chat. The higher we advance up Tartarus, the stronger our enemies will become. Do you feel that your current equipment is adequate? I'm not so sure. In that case... Officer Kurosawa sells equipment. You should go see him when you have the time. By the way... When we were fighting Tartarus, I was thinking... Even Shadows have stuff they're not good at. Like, they have weaknesses, too. Like, how I'm not good at studying, you know? For a sec, I thought they were kind of relatable. <laughs> By the way... I can't believe it's already the last day of April. It was probably one of the hardest months of my life, honestly. I hope I can relax a little next month. Okay, we've definitely still got some time till we're at the full moon, but I think I'm gonna go to, into Tartarus soon. Um, let's see, no. We can actually just go to the store and get takeout now, right? I was gonna go to the computer, but I don't think that's how that works. Now that we have the subscription, I think we can get takeout at the actual store whenever we want. So, let's see what it does. See, it's the top one, right? This one? Okay. Umiyushi Beef Bowls. Welcome. Oh, I see you're a member. We have a member only dish we have member only dishes, so check them out. The website said only members can order takeout. Okay. Um relatively affordable, 300 and 800 yen. Oh, I see. They're actually just like HP items. 20 HP to one ally, 100 HP to one ally. Okay. Thank you. I don't know if that's better than what we can get at the pharmacy. Weird. So I'm wondering if more dishes show up later, like. Hmm. If not, then that's not a very good use of our time. It, it took us one night just to get the subscription. Okay, so it is a little bit better. So medicine at 700 yen restores 50 HP to one ally. And we can get for 800 yen a 100 HP to one ally. So that's that. Most of you got everything you need. Come again, yeah? That's not nothing, I guess. Okay, average level 10, Tartarus floor is 21. Um, yeah, I might go into Tartarus tonight. Let me just see what's here at the arcade tonight. Got a charm one. What are you looking for? Okay, we already got you one of those. 4,500 each. That one adds agility. Now, I think agility helps you with evasion, right? Feel free to buy whatever you want, but I suggest picking something that complements your physique. Is that what you want? Take that what you want. All right, then. Everything look good here? All right, then. What'll it be? 
You can be seen ya. All right, we're gonna buy a couple of those HP items. By a couple, I really do just mean a couple. <laughs> So the Spring Cabbage Bowl, 800 yen, 100 HP to one ally. Uh, this Umiyushi Bowl doesn't seem very good, honestly. Oh, I can o only buy one? Oh, maybe you can only buy one per night. Okay, that's good to know. Cool. I love this song. I love it to death. Let's see what's on TV. Cherry Blossoms blooming near Elmori Castle. We here at Action News recommend getting some fresh air and exercising during Golden Week. Hmm? What's everyone's All status? Right. Everyone can go tonight. Yes. Very well. We'll need a Tartarus around midnight. Don't be late. I'll let the others know. I don't care where those enemies come from, I'll smash them down one right after another. You can count on me. Come on, let's get going. Alright. I don't think those dialogues changed. Our first course of action is going to be a boss fight, so let's just go in with the, what we've got right now. See how we do. Okay, let's get to it. All right. All right. It's enemy territory up ahead. Are you ready for battle? Hold on. I never sit. Eh, it doesn't matter. Salut. Let's go. Hell yeah! Looks tougher than I thought, but ain't nothing stopping me. You're up against a difficult opponent, but if the intel is available, I can help you. I can suggest the most effective attack based on the enemy's weakness. But I can only assist like this when we know the enemy's weakness. I'm sorry, but until you can get more information, you'll be on your own. Don't worry, girl. I've been around the block more than once. I know how this works. R1 for the assist. It will select the attack that's most effective against an enemy. It works as a shortcut to select one of your attacks that targets an enemy's weakness. Take advantage of the shortcut whenever an enemy's weakness is known. I'll go with... Okay, so we got Rakunda. Maybe we'll Secunda the big guy. Make him less likely to hit us. So we'll start with that. Can't stop me now. Oh, we do know these guys' weakness already. Cool. Let's go. Enemy down. What's next? Hit that up, Yori. Now hold on, can we still... Okay, if we push down we can survey. But it does not say who's... Oh, no, it does say who's next, it's Yukari. Gotcha. Okay, with that being the case, I'm gonna shift to analog. I kinda doubt this guy's also weak to Agi, so I'm gonna try Zeo. Then you can try Garu. Alright. That's the stuff right there. Okay, Hoggy and Garu. And he's shocked, that's so good. I'll go with. Okay, we're gonna raccoon to him, and then we're gonna hit him hard. Help me. 
and this might end it. Let's see how much damage we can do with this. Okay, could that fight have gone any better? Great work out there. Honestly, having shift is like a game changer. It just gives you so many more options for managing your SP, managing what abilities you want to use at what time, like, it's good stuff. Ooh, she's gonna get Medea soon, that's good. We can move on now, but the next floor doesn't look any different. You don't think it'll be the same old thing forever, do you? <laughs> Maybe it will be. <laughs> we know. Hmm. <laughs> I get you, Yukitan. Spend too long in the Tartarus Tartar Sauce and anybody be craving for barbecue. <laughs> it's a pretty good line. <laughs> what the heck are you saying? Well, at least you agree it's hard to push through the same thing over and over again. No point overthinking things now. All we gotta do is keep moving forward. After all, I've already made up my mind. Hmm? Oh, look at you all fired up. What's gotten into you all of a sudden? Um, nothing, really. Anyway, enough about me. We gotta keep going, right? Come on, let's get a move on. Alright. Every few floors, there's some kind of gatekeeper. And they're always stronger and nastier than the last. Well, seems like after we beat them once, it's adios forever. So we just gotta come out on top. You tell him, Junpei. Yes, more snuff souls, good. Okay, we need three for this one, so this one better be better than the last. The last one was kind of like a, uh, was a card that we didn't really want. <laughs> okay. Hey. That's a nice looking bow. I can use it, right? Looks pretty good. I mean, I'm never going to push that button not being able to look at it. My guess is that... Oh, wow, yeah. My guess is that it will never give that to you. Like, she won't say that that's a good-looking bow and ask to equip it unless it's better than the one she has. Poison medium. Medium poison's not bad for this point in the game. Like, damn. Okay. Yeah, that, that's a really good upgrade. Quite a bump in attack power, too. Okay, we're gonna go back down and save. Okay, at the moment I have two empty persona slots. Salut. that there's a rare shadow up ahead perhaps you can ambush it Ooh, okay let's see if there is a uh, cruel in this game as they were in portable the rare shadows in that game were a nightmare <laughs> um learning rebellion could be good rebellion is one of those like risk reward abilities increases one ally oh no it's different in this increase one ally's critical rate for three turns um, if I'm not mistaken, Rebellion in Portable would do everybody on the map. Literally everybody on the field. Maybe I'm thinking of the step up from Rebellion, though. Um, but it made it so that the enemies were more likely to crit as well as you. So it was kind of risky. But in this case, that's just a good skill to learn. So let's work on Amoakane's level up. like finding a bit of rancid gravy in a chest. Okay, let's see if he has any kind of pattern here. What? Is that shadow up ahead a...
Hmm. Well, now, that shadow took off like a bandit, didn't it? Those ones are fairly rare. I suppose we can simply call them rare shadows. They can be tough to catch, but the potential rewards are worth the trouble. While exploring Tartarus, you may encounter an elusive rare shadow. Defeating them will net you hefty rewards. Rare shadows will attempt to flee if they spot you. They'll keep running until they successfully escape. You'll want to ambush them from behind and strike quickly. All right. It seems you have turned left up ahead. Why don't you try tracking it down? Okay. Salut. Did we not literally see it run down that direction? <laughs> Okay, they are actually going to be much easier to catch in this Come game. <laughs> Let's take it out here and now. Okay. Usually just rushing what physical was usually the best option for these guys, but I don't know if that's going to be the case here. Okay. I'll go with. Let's see if you resist this. No? Okay. Damn. They're kind of dodge tanks. Don't slow down. The enemy's fled. You almost have it. All right. What's he got to do? Damn it. <laughs> I wanted that. Maybe popping uh, an accuracy debuff would have been useful there. There's a shadow. Damn it. I want to get one of those. I want to see if it does anything. I'm gonna show you what I got. What next? Can't stop now. Okay, we don't want to use Bufu on him then, so are you weak to Zeo? Indeed. Nicely done. Your enemy eliminated. Mostly for just uh, fusions. Let's do the same thing for our next fight. Okay, found the stairs. Well done. We've come. I think. I think I've got something on everybody. I think I'd rather keep the endurance and the strength than the luck band. Let me just double check that it's only a plus one on that luck band. I wanted to see if the gold guy came back. That reminds me. I'm detecting a stronger foe on an upcoming floor, another gatekeeper. It'd be wise to conserve our strength. Have you made use of the escape order? A strategic retreat can mean the difference between life and death. You can always regroup and try again. Okay, when in battle, press up to open the tactics menu and select escape. The battle will end if an escape route can be found after three turns. However, keep in mind that an escape route may not be found. While in the process of looking for an escape route, commands can still be given to other party members. We gotta keep moving. Okay. Man, I don't know why, but it's a lot harder to speak up when it's this quiet. We 
got the upper hand. You have an item that can hit their weakness. This is the perfect time. Okay, so you're Augie and you're Zio. Jarkana. Um, do we currently have a Silky? Yes, we do. Okay, Miragi Gem. Don't really care about that, but we do like the bonuses that we're gonna get from this stuff, so. Okay, so we found the stairs. Okay, so it doesn't seem like the dash attack does anything. Okay, good to know. So Garu, Agi, Bufu. You should be able to hit a weak spot. That's an enemy down. Good job, Takeba. Ready to run. Yes. Here's your chance. You can target a weakness. The enemy's down. Good hit. There, you can go for a weakness. Keeps it snappy. Damn, two in a row, huh? Love it. Skill card Dia, obtain money, defense, experience, money. Let's do the same thing for our next fight. Hey, there's a treasure chest. It's a group of three. You have the initiative. Looks like the enemy's weak to ice. use all that SP to get these guys all down right now. some rank three cards. Okay. We'll take that bonus experience. <laughs> Perfecto. Okay, a speed band. Well done. We've completely mapped out this area.
We don't see that kind of chest often. Let's not pass it up. Ooh, maybe there's something nice in the Okay, you're new. In this situation. For some reason, I actually think that Garu might be the weakness for this guy. Am I? I yep, yeah, I think I've remembered that from my playthrough from a year ago. <laughs> How I don't know, but. <laughs> Oh, he's a tough one. Okay. Oh, you don't have Garu. That's right. You need to save some SP anyway, so... Sometimes with these tough guys, it's sometimes better to not do the all-out and just do an extra attack that will make them dizzy. Sometimes that can be more effective, so... Just thought I'd mention it. Life Drain. I mean, that wouldn't be a bad card to have. I definitely need money. But I'm gonna take Life Drain this time. Okay, this one only costs one, so it's probably going to be a card. God, I don't, like, that's so not worth it. <laughs> Maybe we don't want to pick up the ones. But you have to imagine that sometimes it will be a skill card that's worth it, you know? But didn't we get by Sudi the last time, too? Yeah. We did. One teleporter sighted. That'll take us back to the entrance, but I'm down to keep going. A shadow. There's two. Here's your chance to attack. Here's your chance. You can target right, a weakness. Yeah. You should be able to hit a weak spot. Yeah. Alright, if we get to the top floor and find another boss, there's a strong chance that I'll have to use some of my SP items. We do have one more slot to fill for a persona. Let's do the same thing for our next fight. Down the stairs. We gotta keep moving. Yo, there's a shadow. Okay, I know your accuracy is a little bit lower, buddy, but don't you miss. Okay, let's try just dizzying him this time. one target left. Finish this. Okay, this time it was definitely not worth it. Now, if he'd managed not to get up, it might have been different, but... But you know what? That was two attacks, wasn't it? He failed to get up the first time, and then he attacked a second time. So, eh, give or take. Give or take. We already have Silky, so we'll take money again. Okay, level 9 is good.
Hey, let's loot that chest. These table lanterns and things like that, I need to check and see if those are just things that we sell. Materials and valuables. Okay, yep. They're just things that sell for money. Gotcha. There's a shadow. We got the upper hand. It doesn't look like you can strike any weaknesses. Man, only only main character can down these guys. I got this. Damn, I'm like hoping for a crit here. Save me some SP. God damn it, turn order is screwing me over here. You've got to be fucking kidding me, dude. This isn't going to work. What's next? How about one of me? God damn it. I'm, not, I'm sitting here like trying my hardest to fucking save something. God damn it. We're just not strong enough to outpower them at the moment for that. Oh, that's frustrating. In the end, just ended up costing myself more. <laughs> Sometimes you gotta try, though. Sometimes you gotta try. Um, oh, fully restored? Yeah. Cool. Okay, that'll, that'll save us. I was gonna use items to get our health back up, but... That worked out pretty well. We still have one open slot? Yes, we do. Okay. You know, if I had a better memory, I would know how many floors you needed to climb for each block, but I definitely don't remember shit like that. A shadow. There's right, two! Here's your chance to attack! Okay, Garu skill card. We're starting to get gems. Um, I don't think we'll be able to use gems for quite a while still, but... Alright, and it looks like Junpei now has a buff skill, which is really nice. You always like it when you can get those and it's not just your main character. Okay, those are the Slash Boys. Come. 
The enemy's down. Good hit. Hey, you're me. You to the rescue. Yeah, screw that up. Damn it, Junpei. Fuck, Junpei. Can't afford to lose. Is low. Do you have any healing? You are taking one down. This guy's the last. You are taking one down. I'm ready. Take a time. Go Leave it to me. Takeba's in danger. Pull the trigger. Catch her up. Nice one, you the In this situation, that hit the enemy's weakness. You're doing great, Takeba. What next? Have fun, Persona. Didn't want to risk Junpei going down. <laughs> yeah. Who's up next? Chests look kind of different from the others. Yeah, Two weak enemies. You advantage. have the initiative. Focus. How about one of these? <laughs> Nicely done. Enemy eliminated. Okay, cure water. Hey, there's a treasure chest. All right, steal this. Go for the enemy's weakness to win. In this situation. There you go. Okay with this. Okay, well that set of mobs we can pretty easily auto battle, not waste SP on. Even if they do get a little bit on us, it's like the cost of one Dia versus downing three people with three different abilities is quite a big difference. So, careful, the enemy's nearby. I'm detecting a powerful enemy up ahead. Everyone, stay sharp. 
Salut. I see you're making good progress, and you appear to be getting a hang of things in combat. On the topic, have you been paying attention to enemy weaknesses? Exploiting a weakness will make you hit harder and more often. Doing so can turn the tide of battle. The more kinds of attacks you can use, the more chances you'll have to hit a weakness. That's where your ability comes in handy. Okay, so I think we will use an SP item here. So, Snuff Soul does 50? Damn, that's really good. <laughs> Yeah, okay. That that should be enough to keep us moving. So, that's what we're gonna do. Salut. Just wanted to make sure we saved. Um... Cure waters are 50 to all. Okay, those are useful. Okay, so odd morsels and rancid gravy can only be used in battle. And they have a chance to add a side effect. Salut. Let me remind myself, I think what Junpei got was a, a defense buff on party members, right? Um, let's see, R2 to get to Persona. Increase one ally's defense for three turns, okay. So I think for us, our best options are either to lower this guy's defense or to lower his chance to hit us. Maybe we'll start with the Secunda. Just like we did before. If he's hitting us less, right. we're more likely to survive. It's enemy territory up ahead. Are you ready for battle? Hell yeah! Well, it looks tougher than I thought, but ain't nothing stopping me. I like that outlook, Junpei. The enemy's attacks are growing stronger. If you're being overwhelmed by the enemy's assault, protect yourselves by guarding. If you're guarding, then even if your weakness is struck, you can avoid being knocked down. Try and make use of that in battle. You can guard against an enemy's attack by pressing circle. Guarding will reduce damage by half. Guarding can also keep you from getting knocked down even if an enemy targets your weakness. You will not be inflicted with a status ailment while guarding either. If an enemy is winding up for a powerful attack, or if you think your weakness will be targeted, try guarding to play it safe. Okay, so we're gonna have to see what element this guy throws out, but it's probably gonna be one of the weaknesses for either um, Yukari or Junpei. Okay, Augie is not a weakness. Pull the trigger. Okay, high chance to confuse. We might actually make use of that. Let's just see if we can learn some stuff first, though. Okay, he resists Garu. He's probably gonna be. Oh. Okay, yep. So he, if he's using Garu, then Junpei's the one that needs to guard. What to do? That also means that maybe Zio will help us. Yeah, Zio is often an opposite of Garu, so. This is our ten. Let's Here we go. Maybe should have dizzied him. Can't break me. In this situation. Let's try confuse. Blocks it. Of course he does. I'll go with. Yeah. 
enemy's weak to electricity. Okay, so he did resist Garu, so. The time. I won't lose. Yeah. That was close. Hate that. What to do? Oh, he got it. The enemy. Get ready. Good. We got him. I'll go with Moy Cutter. Excellent work. You hit him. Whoops. That's okay. Well okay. Done. <laughs> Let's continue exploring. I thought Yukari was gonna go next. Which is why I didn't guard with Junpei there. Alright, Mokani, did you learn rebellion? Yeah, level eight rebellion. Okay. And another one bites the dust. We're on a roll, guys. While we're at it, how about we spice things up every now and then? Like by changing up the leader? What? And here I was worried about what you'd say next. Don't you want to see how I'd run this whole shebang? Well, don't you? <laughs> Let's do it. Honestly. Wait, it wouldn't be wise for a change in command in the middle of an expedition. We're making steady progress under Vernacular's lead, so... Let's continue as we have been. Shut down, Junpei. I tried to be a good friend, give you a chance, but Mitsuru Mama didn't let you, so I, nothing I can do about it. Sorry, bro. Fine, sure, I guess. But I'm pretty sure I could just take down the enemies here all by myself. Hey, listen. You really could. Uh, chill out, Junpei. If you're not careful, it won't be long till you get hurt. Takaba's right. We can expect another strong enemy to appear. Don't let your guard down as we as we proceed. Okay, whatever. Guess there's always next time. It's so quiet. We can hear our footsteps echo. Hey, can you hear another pair of footsteps? Sight! <laughs> okay, two of these. This one costs us two. A hothead shirt. Okay. Some hey. armor. Hey, sick armor. I think I, it'd help bring out my inner charm, you know? There's, is there even a way to compare when it does that? Okay, this one will cost three. Okay, so what I'm seeing so far is that threes are weapons, twos are armor, and ones are cards. Yeah? Let's see if that remains true as we move forward. I'm always going to want to compare, so I'm never going to choose those options. Let's see, is that one? F yep, that one's for you. Okay. Magic one and agility one as well. Very nice. Okay. And then we also got armor. Resist freeze. Okay. Okay, Mokane got the skill that I wanted him to learn. Is there a skill on anybody else we really want to try and get? Just getting you more stuff that you can pass on might not be terrible. So getting you Agi. Do we have anybody? Yeah, you have Agi. The thing that we're missing right now with you is Garu. I'm just gonna go and see if there's a, some fusion that I want to do with Pixie. While we're here, Marvelous. I can see that you are living quite the fulfilling life between nurturing your bonds and striving for self-improvement. This is less of a reward and more of a gift from me to you. Please take it. Thank you, girl. Eleven? Okay. I'm looking forward to it. I still cannot foresee the limits of your potential. I look forward to witnessing you grow even further. How may I assist you? 
Man, my girlfriend treats me so good. Registering. Will you register it to the compendium? I've completed registration. I too. Which will you choose? Okay. With Aramitama, a level 11 unicorn, that's too high for us at the moment. Or we can get a Jack Frost. Very well. I don't think we're going to do a fusion right now then. Okay, you know what? We're pretty close to the end of this episode, so um, we'll continue this climb in the next one. So thank you all for being here. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next episode. Have a good one, everybody. Bye.